Hi guys, so I'm filming a couple of workouts today, um, which is Sunday because I'm going up to visit my parents. Um, as if you were with me yesterday, you would have known we're going up to Hull tomorrow, driving up and back in one day. So no chance to film, I would imagine. So I'm, I'm getting them done today, Sunday. Aren't you lucky? Um, today's is um, backs. So we're going to do um, the, the 10 minute back workouts. If you're new to all of this, then it's 10 minutes every day, Monday to Friday, different body parts. So we're going to revisit some of the original back exercises that I taught. Um, so if you lie down onto your front, good, and the chin will be tucked, your arms will be down by your sides. So I would like you, get that in the right place, tucking the chin, arms down by the sides, tuck your bottom under, feet firmly on the floor, lift your shoulders, then your hands, hands down, shoulders down. Shoulders up, hands up, hands down, shoulders down. Now your forehead can be rested on the mat. I find it a little bit easier just to hover slightly. But make sure you tuck your chin to hover your head slightly. Now you pull your shoulder blades together, then you lift your hands, hands down, shoulders down. Common mistakes is to sort of use the back a little bit too much here. So actually keeping your forehead in contact vaguely with the floor is definitely a good thing. So another problem people, um, or another mistake people make is to keep the elbows just a little bit bent. So if you lock your elbows out straight, you will also be working those triceps, which is always good. So make sure you pu uh, push your fingertips down towards your toes, which pulls your ears, pulls <laughs> your shoulders away from your ears. <laughs> I've been training for a couple of hours this morning, so I'm a bit tired. Good. <laughs> Continue on with the shoulders up and the hands up, and we're pulsing the hands up and down. Recheck the pelvis, tuck your bottom under. Breathing, so this is good. Shoulder rehab. Anyone who's had any shoulder problems, this is really good because it's working all the muscles around your shoulder blades. Now turn your palms down and pulse your arms up and down. Getting some nice breaths in. Good. What is that, Cam? Okay, just put just put it down on the island. Keep pulsing up and down. Palms facing in now, circle out. Keeping your bottom tucked under, your chin tucked, your forehead down. If not on the mat, just hovered off the mat. Now circle the other way. Now things should be burning a little bit in the backs of the arms and around the shoulder blades. Good, now rest for a second. Okay. So for the next one, we're going to have the arms out to the side there, tucking that chin, tucking the bottom under, lift and down, lift and down. Good. This one may be a little bit different because I think the first time I might have done it with some little weights, maybe some tin cans or something. So we may feel this one's just a little bit different today, which is nice, going for a little bit more endurance. Try and get those breaths in. Try and keep the shoulders down away from the ears. Good. Three, two, one. Brilliant. They're hard these, so if you are finding them hard, you're not alone. They are difficult exercises. Okay, so we're going to have the arms back out in that position again, and we're going to stretch forwards and back. If you can do this on your grass, it's a fantastic feeling to just brush your hands along the grass and then pull back again but not everybody has that opportunity so tuck your chin forehead on the mat off we go one if you get scared there'll be bees in there though two or wasps three four think about pulling the elbows down five six keep tucking your bottom under or your back will get sore keep your forehead vaguely in contact with the mat this will be strengthening your neck as well Eight, stretch all the way out to let's try and do another ten two five eight 
nine, ten. Lovely, good. So good burn around your shoulder blades. We do tend to work the fronts of our chests a little bit too much with a lot of the exercises that we do, everything's out in front of us. So to work around the shoulder blades and the upper back is fantastic. Good, up onto the elbows. Make a diamond here. I think I've done these recently. Good, no Lily, not now Bubba. Drop and lift. Scoop in your tummy, drop and lift. This is how many times my children ask me for food. Within 10 minutes of filming. No Cam. Eight. Nine. Ten, draw in your lower tummy. Two. Four, dropping your chest down and then picking up and away. Good. So it gives you a good sort of feel of where those shoulder blades are. Good. On your front again, tuck your chin. And then we're going to do big circles around here now. One. <laughs> Let's try and do ten. Two. Three. Four. Keep your bottom tucked under. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's keep them out to the side, tucking the chin, lifting and lowering. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can do twenty. Nine, ten, another ten. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lovely. On to your side. Knees together, feet together. Make a pillow for your head. Good. This arm out in front. Breathe in, breathe out and rotate. Good. Two. Tuck that bottom back as if you're doing a clam exercise. Five. And then we're going to scoop round in a circle. One. Two. My lower back clicked then, so you often get that with these exercises. Three. Keep your head down a little bit. Four. What was that? Butterfly. Nice. Same again on this side. One. Two. I think it's all right. Five. Good. And again, I'll come and look in a minute. One. I don't know. <laughs> Two. Three. Four. Five. I'm just checking how long we've done. Uh, nine minutes. So time for just one more. Hands and knees, I think, as far as backs are concerned. And let's do the thread the needle. So reaching up, bend the arm, three, one. Try not to touch the arm on the floor this time for something new. Two. Just skim above. Three. Breathe in. Lovely. Other side. Stretch up, back of the hand, and hover. One, two. Makes that right arm work a little bit more. Three, four, five. Lovely. So there is your 10 minutes today um, on backs. I hope you enjoyed it. 
Hope you're having a good day. Um, we'll be back with you tomorrow for, can you believe it, the eighth time round of these five different body weight exercise, uh, body parts exercises. Um, I'm enjoying filming them. I hope you're enjoying watching them. Please make sure you pop me a comment on YouTube. I do love to hear about how how you're getting on it feels like there's a little community of people getting on with these exercises it's really lovely and it helps me to keep going filming them and it helps to grow my youtube channel take care guys have a good day bye